Hi, welcome to another Power Blast podcast. Happy 2012 to you. First podcast of this year, number 251 on the episode list. And um, this year has really started off as a blur for me, um, for our family. It's just, just some amazing, bizarre, sad things going on that um, kind of stressed us out. And uh, I know last week I was telling you, you know, some of the workout programs that I was doing and um, starting the new year and just testing things out. And I did, I started those things, but, um, you know, not to, to make this podcast a downer, um, but just kind of, I, I guess to illustrate a point, um, on Christmas morning we woke up and uh, our, uh, we woke up at like 4 a.m., had to rush our cat to the emergency and ended up having to put her down a uh, very unexpected uh, situation there um, came out of nowhere a, a blood clot thing and then um, for those of you that know my German Shepherd Owen uh, and the fact that he has Scott syndrome and um, uh, a blood disorder that has no cure and um, he needed a transfusion, and you know I might even be taken off later today. That's why I'm doing the podcast right now um, to head uh, up to a university for him, uh, hoping the best for him. But and, and just a few other little external factors is just kind of starting the year off in like a zombie state. It's it's uh, it's crazy. It's stressful. It, it, it's not it, it things you can't control. Um, you can make some decisions, but you know so, some of them are very hard, very sad decisions. Um, which brings me to my point today. Um, I did go ahead and start P90X2 this week, and I've done remarkably well. Now the workouts have humbled me quite a bit, um, and but I, I and, and I'm sore in really great places and everything like that. Um, and I'm liking the workouts, and I didn't think I'd be able to to come full force with with some of the some of the moves. And while I'm still uh, unsure of my shoulder, I think that's uh, it boils down to a confidence issue there. Um, I'm doing what I can, or I'm making the modifications. And uh, you know, you can see I'm about ready. I'm, I'm heading into my yoga session here, and. Liking it. It, it, challenging enough, and uh, just a very, uh, just kind of new experiences with with uh, with the fitness. A lot of core work um, that I've done so far. Um, that you know, th that's this foundation phase that we're in. Um, you know, so we got a, a lot of core work, and a, you know, um, just uh, challenging the body in in new ways. Now, speaking of challenging the body, I have also added in Les Mills Pump. That one uh, is another program that I think uh, you need to take a serious look at. It's just a blast. Um, high reps, for those of you, uh, there's a lot of people out there going, oh, what is it, a bunch of, a bunch of heavy weights? Because you see the barbell, but you're only putting on light weights or light plates onto that thing and um, just doing a massive amount of reps, which just all of a sudden just fires the muscles and you get to that that point where you're like, ah, oh, I can't push through, and that's what they call that rep effect where all of a sudden you just gotta kick in, just bang out some more, um, and and you feel that burn, but you just feel so empowered after it. So doing, a, you know, it's not two a day, two workouts a day I'm doing. Uh, I'm blending in the, uh, you know, whatever cardio days that I have uh, with P90X, which P90X2, X2 I should say, is only five days a week, um, then, I'm offsetting with some, you know, the, those cardio days like plyocide. Then I do uh, a Les Mills pump workout. So really loving it, uh, having a blast. And um, you know, then I can, I can do that workout with Hillary too. Uh, from time to time, we did uh, pump and pump and shred or something like that, or pump and burn uh, last night, and a, a great little 30-minute workout that had us sweating bullets and, and really liking it and cranking up the volume. So um, the point I guess I sh should, should illustrate here is, you know, even though my mind may not be 
totally 100% into the workouts. I'm doing the best I can. So, so the thing I'm, I'm realizing is um, I'm, look, I'm doing the things that I do have control of and, you know, taking time to take care of myself. It would be very easy to just kind of wallow and, and do nothing because, yeah, I mean, a lot of t and just kind of walking around and there's this stress and pressure and stuff like that. Um, but still taking that time to, to work that in, um, you know, if I do go on the road, I may uh, need to decide what I'm going to take with me and what I can do. That'll be interesting to see how, uh, how well P90X2 travels. Um, I'm not going to take the barbell set and all that with me, although I could because that uh, barbell disassembles. But, um, you know, when, when, you, when you hit those, those obstacles, those crossroads, etc., put in what you can. Um, you, you may not be 100%. You may not be totally into it. Um, and you may just kind of go through the motions. But um, it's something that you can control uh, when life wants to throw you all sorts of curves. Um, you know, and, and I know a lot of people will invent their own excuses, um, you know, that when they don't even have the stressors, they'll put those in anyway and make up the excuses of, of why not to. But uh, you, need to, you need to decide why to. So anyway, I uh, thought I'd share that. I wanted to share some video footage from the week, but I just did, frankly didn't get any, any taken. So you just have to go with my message for the day. Anyway, I hope your year is off to a, an amazing start. <laughs> Sorry for the little bit of the downer stuff, but really, uh, I, I am enjoying the workouts um, as best as I can, and uh, and and doing some things, and they're, they're challenging, you know, quite challenging. This this year is going to really turn around and improve. Uh, I know it, but uh, got to take care of business first. So anyway, just remember, it's never too late. We'll see you next week.